नमस्ते सभी जनालाई अहिले म यो एउटा भिडियो लिएर आएको छु यो चाहिँ अहिले सामाजिक सञ्जालमा सारै नै भाइरल भइरहेको छ यो भिडियोमा के हुन्छ भन्दाखेरि विदेशमा एउटा लाइन्सकेपिङ कम्पनी हुन्छ र त्यो कम्पनीले चाहिँ एउटा क्लाइन्टको लागि चाहिँ उसको गार्डनमा घाँस लगाउँछ र अब त्यहाँ के भयो भन्दाखेरि त्यो गर्दनीले चाहिँ उसलाई पैसा तिर्न इन्कार गर्छ इन्कार गर्नु कारण के हो भन्दाखेरि त्यो घाँस चाहिँ पहिलो भयो भनेर भन्छ अनि कम्पनीले के क्लेम गरिरहेको छ भन्दाखेरि उनीहरूले चाहिँ अब आफ्नो इन्स्ट्रक्सन अनुसार पानी दिनु भनेर घरबेटीलाई भनेको हुँदो रहेछ र घरधनीले चाहिँ त्यो अनुसारले प्रपर इन्स्ट्रक्सन फलो नगरेको र अब घाँसहरू सबै पहेँलो भएर जाँदो रहेछ अनि त्यो पैसा नदिएको झोकमा चाहिँ त्यो कम्पनीले के गर्छ भन्दाखेरि त्यहाँ भएभरको सबै घाँस जुन जति लगाएको छ त्यो सबै फिर्ता लिएर जानको लागि आउँछ यो भिडियोमा चाहिँ अब अगाडिदेखि अब उसले कसरी फिर्ता लगेको छ र त्यो टाइममा चाहिँ घरबेटीले अब कसरी उसलाई बिहेभ गरिरहेको छ यो पुरै भिडियो चाहिँ तपाईँहरूले हेर्न सक्नुहुन्छ I don't want, you know, it doesn't look good, this and that. I'm like, yeah, but you didn't water it. You were advised on how to cater for your grass. You didn't do it. Everything I said to try and be cooperative wasn't pleasing her. This customer refused to pay for Caitlin's landscaping work. So I look at my employee, I'm like, she's refusing to pay. So the second half of what she owes us is what we paid for our grass. So take up the grass. So let me show you. Here is what we've done so far. This is what she was complaining about. But if you look, a neighbor's grass is just as yellow because of the heat wave. So here we are taking up the grass. He's doing the backyard right now and I'll show you the final product. Look, she's videotaping me, even though she's the one refusing to pay. We've already called the police, so that's so fun. Owning a business is so fun. We're just gonna take this loss, take this L. That's so good. After not being paid, Caitlin decided to take what was hers. Try rip them, yeah, so she can't relay them. First case being when I got there, and I approached the door politely and I was expecting the check and uh, spoke to her. She came off arrogant right away. I, you don't have an invoice, uh, you don't have this and that. Every time she had said something, I don't have a printer, like I responded accordingly. I could send you it by email. I can, you know, print it at home and bring it to you tomorrow. Then like nothing was pleasing her. So it was going back and forth for a little while where I'm trying to find a solution. I'm like, we did tell you, like you did need to pay today. Uh, it, at this point, it had been almost a week and a half. She hadn't paid. This situation caught a lot of attention on the street. construction guys pass by because they're doing work right there and they're like no way what's going on I'm like she didn't pay so there goes her grass this is our grass now so I guess we can give it to her for free but upside down current state of her house oh she went in her house she's shy I guess camera shy she's telling them she paid in full she's telling them she literally paid in full but she didn't so we're taking our grass the woman admitted that she was never going to pay. So after the whole conversation with her, I was like, look, he told you if you don't pay, you're not gonna keep the product. You said that's fine, cause you were gonna pay. So I'm like, so what's happening right now? And she looks at me arrogantly and goes, I'm not gonna pay, so take your grass. So I called her bluff and we took her grass. So it was her word to take it off. So we did that. So it's not illegal. She called for it, she got it. It wasn't trespassing. We had an open contract with her, which is now closed and she gets her discount of not paying. She also texted uh, my boyfriend the day that the job had finished saying, thank you for a job well done because the grass was laid correctly and properly. And she also texted us after the fact when he called her and was like ripping her a new one about how rude she was to me. She said she ever, never had an intention of paying and she called me a dog. This isn't how Caitlin wanted this situation to go, but she had no choice. Literally have people watching now. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, you very go. much. Everybody's helping out. Almost done, lawn is almost done. Everybody's standing around, to see what's going on. What? Their little Mercedes in the driveway. Can't pay their grass. Sucks. That's how the story goes. 
they didn't pay we had a whole audience ripped up all their grass and we're leaving it there so it's a warning sign for anybody who wants to do their grass next why do you think it looks like that because they didn't pay it's sad how so many people don't pay for work that's been done and it's so it's so sad because contractors or small businesses or landscapers you get if you do the work and then they refuse to pay what are you gonna do well luckily we can rip the grass up but some people can't you know undo your whole driveway or you know pull out all the trees they put in or take your roof off like i hate people that just think they can over smaller businesses just someone trying to make a living in the world and like we told you what to do how to take care of your grass like you're old you should have known this i just am so blown away by it all right job well done thank you sir this situation is seen way too often for small businesses but i'm glad caitlin decided to stand up for her business and take back what was hers after the customer refused to pay for works that had already been done now, many people in the comments were happy with Caitlin's reaction to this situation. This person said, lol, stand your ground. Good for you. People want freebies. Another commented on their experience working at a landscaping company, just like Caitlin's. They said, I work for a landscaping company in the office and the amount of people that ended up not paying was astounding. My boss had to close the business. And others were just happy that Caitlin called this woman's bluff and actually took her grass back. One person said, I love people who think because the work is done that it can't be undone. Anything can be undone. <laughs> have you ever had a job not paid for? Or have you not paid for a job? Let me know in the comments below. And as always, thanks for watching.